Everybody wants attacking football, right? And the point's going to be bravery, and we're going to do it. It's, it's our attitude that's going to be ruthless, sharp. We're not looking to win games 1-0. We're not looking to get a goal and sit back. You know, we ask for everyone's patience because it's a brand new staff, brand new team, new identity. But I think everyone will buy in, and those are the players that we want to have joining us and moving forward for this season. the surface of this. There's somebody who has a really great heart, uh, sees the human aspect of what football is about as well and how it brings people together and they can resonate with everybody at every single level of the club so that we're all pulling in the same direction and when we achieve success and even on the days if we have some losses that we all win and we lose together but we're all trying to push to that next level and demand more of each other and I think that that's something that, that Patrice is really going to, to harness and he's going to be encouraged to do so as well in the time that he's uh, getting going here. For me and for Derek as well, it was about finding the right coach in Patrice who has a proven track record of taking players from a certain level and developing them and helping them go to the next level, which is what the Canadian Premier League is all about. And it's somebody who has a little bit of that underdog mentality as well and is willing to graft and, and work night and day to achieve success on and off the pitch. I mean, listen, it, it's easier to say you're the underdog than the favorites because if favorites comes, you know, expectations and pressure and all that, but I, I feel like wherever I've coached, you know, my journey at Seneca College was the exact same. Took on a program that hadn't made the final four for nine years, and in our first year we did it. And then we finished this past season as the runner-up in the country. So, yeah, it, it motivates me and keeps me moving, but I also know that this past season at Vaughan, we started the season as favorites, and we had a lot of things going for us. So, the ambition is there to just get better. I think that's the biggest goal that I have in my mind. And, you know, I think at this level, you know, for sure, it, it's a little bit different because it's, it's that underdog. And I feel like the city of Halifax is an underdog. So my identity, our team, and the city match. And hopefully in a year or two that'll change and we'll be the favorites and it's a different kind of feeling. I've been ready for this for quite some time in my mind. But to be here, it's, uh, you feel the excitement. It's also a celebration of what I've been able to achieve. But I am looking forward for the next chapter and repeating exactly what I've done at the different levels and moving forward.